All right, at this time of recording this video, we are currently like, uh, let's say 40-ish, yeah, 40-ish hours until all for one releases. Uh, no marketing tweet yet, no uh, no gameplay, no nothing. So, life sucks, <laughs> that's there. Uh, but they are marketing something. They've officially confirmed that the uh, Karen, what is it, character guaranteed acquisition banner is real. And today I thought I'd share it with you just to confirm the uh, the thing there. I could finally show the asset to you um, as they have now officially shared it. Uh, we're trying to play safe on that on that front. But uh, today, let's jump into it. We'll talk about all some other stuff that I also want to compile into this video. I have to make sure you're getting all the stuff before the season goes and... Uh, well, this is not concludes, but before the next banner comes out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Let's hop into it. New to the channel. As always, like and subscribe. Helps out a ton. Let's hop over there. So this is the tweet that was shot out again from the JP account. Let me just refresh it real quick. I'm curious, though. They haven't been doing too hot on the uh, the likes anymore. Uh, so it's been a little bit since the tweet came out. And it's only at 649. Back in the day, dude. Remember when when, when Ultra Rumble got 1,000 likes within like 20 minutes? <laughs> oh, my God. Those days are no more. <laughs> They're long gone. Uh, they put this tweet out. Uh, basically, again, it's showing us the banner. I'll read through the tweet in a second here. It does confirm a sad fact of it all. We expected it, right? We didn't, we didn't think anything else of it. Uh, what does that translate to? I'll tell you right now. Pretty sure that just says character guaranteed role. Uh, but we do have the characters that are, are available, basically, uh, for acquisition here, which is very cool, correct? Again, an asset that I didn't kind of get to show. Uh, this says in the middle, character confirmed gotcha. So basically, again, character guaranteed role. It basically confirms that you will get an SSR. You will get a rather plus ultra in this game, it's called. Um, and you will get a character. Which are the characters? We'll talk about that in a second. So again, you do have Ibarra over here. You have Endeavor. You have Aizawa. You have Momo. You have Kendo. You have Kirishima. You have the one and only Ida. Oh my god. And you have um, Deiki Kaminari. Is this ticket good? Let's be honest here. For new players, this is amazing. This is a great way for you to start your account in a nice way. Uh, this is also a great way for anybody with like firing an alt account to get a free character, correct? <laughs> it's very simple. Uh, so if you do have an alt account, I do highly recommend that you just log in on it and uh, do that. Um, remember, as always, there are a lot of people in my comment section. I will say about 30 to 40% of this community has an alt account in this game, which is good, right? Helps you get characters. Just make sure to save on it, <laughs> right? Um, and just do things proper. But it, for what it is, it's a free character. Cool. For, pl for players, that basically have like a very good account and that have kind of played since let's say a month or two you probably have most of the bottom roster correct like this onwards to this these two you might not have so for you it's basically a two out of six to to get something good which how good is that chance wait two out of eight sorry 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 let's make that clear one two three four five six seven eight okay two out of eight not the best chance, <laughs> right? Not the best chance, but um, it is it is a chance together, correct? Uh, so again, for most players, realize also that this character is on Hero Ticket, this character is on Hero Ticket. We'll talk about that in a second. On Hero Ticket, on Hero Ticket, on Hero Ticket, not. So really, theoretically, you kind of want to pull these two for most players, but there are some people missing these characters. So for what it is, you know, uh, it's only really good for newer players or players that don't have all the characters, uh, which is more so newer players, right? For older players, you got them all. You got them all. Um, but hey, maybe you want to save some uh, hero souls so it's good for you. Who knows? Here we go. This is what the tweet says over here again. Guaranteed character acquisition. A new event is coming up. Get a special gotcha ticket and spin the special gotcha when you are guaranteed to get a character. Where you are guaranteed to get a character. Uh, check the image for available characters. Maybe you can get this character or that character you've been wanting. Do not miss this opportunity. Very cool to, uh, tweet here. Again, confirming one simple thing. Maybe, maybe you get the character you're looking for, correct? And spin the special gotcha. Two words that basically tell us, oh, it's not a selection SSR. It would have been so cool if they made this a selection thing. Like, oh, I can actually pick one of the characters that I want. Uh, sadly, it's not the case, correct? That's why I was saying, like, cope. Cope, boys, cope. <laughs> Maybe they allow us uh, to pick one of the characters. But sadly, they've confirmed it. This is a gotcha. This is a basically two out of eight chance for if you're looking for these two. It's, let's say you want one of the characters. It's a one in eight chance, which for most players, you're not getting Jack. So again, there is that. I still hope that maybe they release a server, a uh, server, a uh, server, no, survey at some point saying like, hey, what should we do, right? The biggest thing this game has to do is take hero souls and make them useful. There is literally no point to sit on hero souls, which is what I hate more than anything. It is like the most useless currency ever. It's like, oh, I can use hero souls every two months, correct? That's when a character releases and a new character gets added to the character ticket, which again, nicely segues to my next topic. Kirishima officially will be added to the character ticket next. He will be there once all for one releases. So again, make sure you pick your Kirishima up. Let's say you wanted Kirishima, you failed over here in acquiring him. Well, guess what? You can actually just pick him using the character ticket, which again, let's say you don't have enough hero souls. If you get a dupe from this banner, you can just trade that in for a Kirishima. So again, the character ticket system is also a flawed system as they release a character every two months. So 
the character ticket never really gets updated per se. And again, the currency doesn't get used. I'm telling you, please, if you watch my beta videos, I beg of you, dude, like tell them to make that thing a reality, right? You could actually take your hero souls, correct? And buy half a character or a gotcha ticket, right? And every time you trade in those things, you make a full ticket and then start gaining tickets from it, right? I think it was like 10 hero souls per half ticket. So it was like 20 hero souls per ticket. Whatever it is, it's something, <laughs> right? You used to also back in the beta be able to use gold for uh, tickets, right? If they let us farm currency and like at least gain some stuff there, it would do the game would be so much better but hey character ticket guaranteed again that's how they're doing it how are they giving this to you how do you acquire this you want that answer here you go basically how you acquire this thing over here is going to be through the mission event just like the mission event usually has it's called a mission event which means it requires you to do missions the only mission you got to do is go and play one ranked match basically i think you just have to get to the first league which all you gotta do to do that is play a match i'm pretty sure i think there's no actual grinding required other than one match uh so you get to like the, uh, the league it requires you to which is like the, the lowest league literally just rank uh by playing ranked for the season once you do that, uh, basically just die of spawn or uh, get a kill or do whatever you want. Uh, just finish the match, conclude the match without quitting out, and then boom, you get yourself a character ticket. It'll be granted to you through the newest mission event, uh, which, by the way, they have shown it. It's like a rainbow ticket. Uh, it is for free, correct? This thing doesn't per se confirm it's for free, but there was that image over there that confirmed it and said it already. That, again, being this beautiful little, uh, little item over here, that basically is what we're going to be getting over here. Um, as our little freebie again, it literally shows the two character skins here on the right, uh, left and right basically again being uh, I think Denki and uh uh, Bakugo for the mission event so again you just complete one little mission get it for free go ahead and spin on the event see if you get anything good here uh, for what it is it's not bad I, I think that it's again a nice little freebie for everybody it just sucks that most players can't really you know kind of use it and uh, have fun with it right most of us will just get dupes but if they if they literally took the hero soul system and just made it a little bit more like oh I can actually use the currency on something correct I get it I can use it on skins and stuff right but it's like you know how much you have of it to a degree, it could be good in like at least either opening up the hero uh, ticket to skill kits, just an idea, um, or just making it where you can at least exchange that for maybe some some summons here and there. Because it's like you're not getting an insane amount of it, but after a while, it just builds up, and you really can't spend it other than on skins, right? So there is that. Uh, beyond that, last little thing that I want to mention, TV anime broadcast commemorative campaign is still going on. Make sure you've claimed it to commemorate the, again, uh, broadcast of the My Hero Academia TV anime. It looks like this is going to be starting this week up until when it stops airing. So we have plenty of uh, gifts to go through. It's just, it has to be tickets every week and then we're saved. <laughs> you know what I mean? To a degree, we're saved. It, if it's like next week, gallery pieces. We're all dead. <laughs> it's back to square one again. Uh, but if it's every week, 50 gotcha tickets, oh my God, we are eating good. If they all of a sudden say next week, oh, 10. 10 gotcha tickets, take it or leave it, we're back to dead, so we shall hope, we shall hope, but make sure you've claimed it, 50 gotcha tickets is 50 gotcha tickets, nothing to laugh at, that is a pretty good amount of gotcha tickets, uh, it could have been 100, true, I saw that, but uh, it's not the 100 million celebration theoretically, it's just the anime celebration, but they didn't give us a gift for the 100 million then, right, I thought that was the gift for the 100 million, it looks like they just didn't give us one, so depression, but that's it, all for one releases within uh, 40 hours, uh, get, uh, get your gift here. Uh, free character confirmed. Uh, Kirishima's coming to the banner. Free character is confirmed officially not to be a selective ticket, which is depressing. It's a roll banner. It's no pity. It's just good luck, uh, good night, and don't lose. <laughs> you know what I mean? Eh, you know what I mean. All right. Take care.